Pisces. Hey Pisces, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Pisces. If you're new to my channel, I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning and trust me with your energy. So, so the first message we have here is, I've never done this for anyone. Wow, so there's a very powerful energy coming through with this card here. And this is the energy of a masculine who is realizing that you are the exception to the rule of divine feminine. And you always have been. So whether you know it or not, they've been in this position many, many times before where they're about to make a decision or take an action that's heavily influenced by your energy. Your person is definitely about to take a leap of faith. But what's interesting is that whatever they're planning to do is not something spontaneous at all. This move is extremely calculated. So this is something that they've been planning for a while now. I'm picking up on a very dominant masculine energy who is also very analytical, meaning that everything they do and every move that they make has a higher purpose. So the timing, the energy, the mood, everything has to be right and make sense to them. And for whatever reason, they feel like now is the time for them to make a move. But what's sticking out to them now is your energy, okay? And it's kind of like they have everything set up on their end, but the only thing stopping them is these kind of recurrent thoughts of you, Divine Feminine. So maybe they don't know how you'll feel about this, but you are definitely a major key in their entire plan. So some of their thoughts, you know, that are coming up is, you know, what if Divine Feminine is not on the same frequency, okay? What if you're not feeling the same intensity that they're feeling at this time? Or what if you're not on the same page mentally and or emotionally, okay? They fear that this could go in a totally different direction. So you may not have any idea of what's going on, Divine Feminine. This may be a masculine you haven't spoken to in a while, but even with the distance, you still feel energetically linked to them in some way. And these feelings are very mutual. So they've been here on many, many occasions where they've kind of said to themselves, wow, I've never done this for anyone, okay, except this Divine Feminine. So I'm picking up on a feminine energy that has always been viewed in a certain light with this masculine. And they feel like they kind of had to be very, very calculated with you, especially in how they express themselves. And this is mainly because you have this ability to truly see them in a way that may be a little intimidating. So there are certain things that have taken place in this connection that you may view as normal. But if your person were to be 100% honest with you, they would tell you that you are the only person that has the power to kind of make them do these things or even to get a certain reaction out of them. And this moment is no different, okay? So whatever this is, it definitely feels urgent. It feels time sensitive. Um, they definitely could have given themselves a certain time frame to get this done. But what's sticking out here is that they've never been in this position before. So whatever they're about to do, you are the reason and the driving force behind this. That's being highlighted. And whatever it is that your person is up to, their energy is directly affecting your connection because they're about to take a huge risk, okay? It's almost as if this masculine knows that life will never be the same after this if, if this goes as planned, okay? They know that this will definitely direct both of your lives, okay? Directly affect both of your lives in a major, major way. So if your person is definitely dealing with a lot of mixed emotions at this time, and they may be very, very nervous. I'm also getting unexpected. So this may definitely be a move that you are not expecting from them at all, okay? This may even seem out of character on their part, Divine Feminine. But whatever they're about to do is definitely opening up another side of them. Maybe a side that they haven't even shown you, okay? But they planned this. It's, it's, their energy feels very, very intentional, okay? This is very strategic and very calculated. Let's get the next message here. So 
So the next message we have here is no more secrets. Wow. Okay, so if you haven't seen your person or spoken to your person in a while, or there's just something off with the communication or your interactions, you may think that you know the reason why Divine Feminine, but I'm getting clearly that the truth will actually shock you, okay? I'm picking up on a feminine energy that deeply feels as if your connection is riddled with secrets. And this has been the biggest barrier between you and your person. It's like you can't quite put your finger on it, but you feel on an intuitive level that this masculine is holding back some vital information from you. And this information is tied directly to how they feel about you. This is not involving anyone else, okay? This is a very personal energy coming through. But this could have definitely been the cause of many, many mixed signals or misinformation within your connection. So even though you're at a distance from your person, something within you needs to know the truth. Because I'm getting something about their actions, specifically how they communicate with you when you do communicate. Their actions are not lining up with, with what it is that you're feeling internally. And this is beginning to bother you because I'm picking up on a feminine energy who has received major confirmation about this masculine. So the fact that things are aligning is beginning to make you question everything, okay? But what's interesting is that when this card pops up, okay, it's usually pointing to a major confession. And I feel like this could definitely be what this masculine is planning here. Um, I'm also getting something about tricky kind of energy. So this could be a very tricky dynamic, okay? Something about the way this whole thing unfolded is very different from anything your person ever experienced. They may feel like this connection caught them completely off guard in a sense, okay? That's coming through clearly. And they definitely may have been playing by a different set of rules when it comes to you, Divine Feminine. This is definitely the energy of a masculine who has been stuffing down their emotions for a while now. And they were really, really good at doing this because I don't think you even know how much they feel, like how deeply they feel for you. That's being highlighted at this time, okay? And they're realizing that because they chose to keep this information concealed, it's definitely played a huge part in why your connection is where it is today. And this is not sitting well with them, okay? So a lot of the secrets, that have been withheld i feel like you're at this place divine feminine where you're ready for them to kind of come to the forefront and your person is in this energy as well okay because i'm getting that in the past they navigated this connection in a very very specific kind of way okay because it allowed them to be in control of the direction but that's about to change very very soon okay Something is happening on your person's end where your energy or just the energy in general is coming through so powerful to your masculine that they feel like they really have no control over what's about to happen. So I feel like there's definitely a higher power over this connection, but more importantly, over this issue or this barrier that you both are currently facing. And things are definitely about to shift in a way that you both will not be expecting, okay? Because I'm picking up on a connection where things may be appearing one way externally, but internally you both definitely have a hard time moving on from this connection, even though you're at a distance, even though things may feel a little bit uncertain at this time, okay? So things, there's a lot that hasn't been expressed verbally, and... This is the energy of a masculine who has some deep emotions and thoughts about you. And it's beginning to have an, a direct effect on their emotional body. So they're experiencing something very intense. There may be a lot of 5D exchanges at this time as well. So there could be something here about your dreams where you're picking up on information, Divine Feminine. Um, yeah, something is definitely happening on an energetic level here. And I'm getting that this is mainly stemming from this masculine realizing that they never really offered you the truth about the extent of their feelings, okay? 
So there's a lot of signs being sent to them at this time. You could be receiving this, these signs as well, Divine Feminine. Okay, so the next message we have is the tables have turned. Okay, so if this message is resonating with you so far, this is definitely giving you a deeper look into your person's mental and emotional process while being away from you. And there has been a major shift in how they currently view you at this time versus how they viewed you in the past, okay? Um, whether you know it or not, Divine Feminine, you changed this masculine, okay? You went directly into their heart space and kind of shifted the way that they operated within this connection here. But this is a change that had to take place within themselves and with them being by themselves. So even though you are at a distance, this has really been a time of healing and repairing for your person, which may be totally out of their character. I'm getting that you've kind of been here before where this masculine may have taken time away from you to kind of indulge in distractions, but something about this feels different. And that's why their emotions are so intense, why they feel this sense of urgency and why they feel like they're ready to kind of make a move that they've never made before. Because although the tables have turned where your person has kind of went from this energy of wanting to kind of be in control, being very strategic, um, holding back from you in a sense, kind of fighting their emotions and stuffing down what it is that they feel for you. Now that they're in this place where they've actually taken the time to purge a lot of these emotions and a lot of these things that have been causing them to act in this way, they feel like it's too late, okay? This is someone who feels like or who, or who felt like they will always have access to you in some kind of way. And maybe this is how you made them feel. I'm getting that this is a very mutual connection. This is someone who... It's absolutely in love with you, Divine Feminine, and you love this masculine as well. But their lack of expression definitely became a major barrier in this connection, okay? And this is almost as if it's being pointed out here that there was a huge fear of them, you know, being exposed in this way. They often wonder what you would do if you really knew just how much they loved you, okay? that you actually had a much deeper access than you know, or that you had the ability to kind of pull on their strings emotionally in a way that they have never experienced. So if you're wondering why your person came across as if they just had to be in control of the direction, this is why they came into this with a very specific timeline for this connection. This is someone who is very, very calculated but not in a malicious way, in a way where everything just had to make sense to them. So the way that they courted you, the time that you spent, every single detail of your connection had a much deeper reason to this masculine. And they just experienced a massive shift where they had to face some very uncomfortable truths. And that is that the biggest barrier in your connection was their inability to be upfront, okay? This masculine views you in a certain light, Divine Feminine, based upon what you showed them. And deep down, they felt like you will always be theirs. But as of recently, they no longer feel as confident about their position in your life. So I'm not sure if you were the one to kind of call this connection off, if you've been focusing on yourself, or maybe you're just in a place in life where you're open to meeting new people. And even that is such a different energy than you were in in the past, okay? But this is definitely pointing to a connection where the universe may have you both in two different places at this time. And when this first happened, this separation happened, or this break, or this, you know, lag in the communication happened, your masculine was not happy about this at all, but they kind of grew to accept this, knowing that deep down, you both would come back together, you know, like you always do or the way that they planned or in a way that was kind of revealed to them by a higher power. But as of recently, something about where you both are in life definitely has them a little bit nervous here, okay? And they're worried that they were wrong about making these assumptions about you in this connection. 
there's a huge regret when it comes to keeping these things from you and not really expressing their feelings, okay? The biggest thing that they have realized, and, and this is why they really want to clear the air with you, Divine Feminine, they realize that there's only one you, okay? This is someone who has had many experiences, but what they come to realize is that they will never find another you in any time or in any space. And that realization has completely rocked their world. It's kind of taken them from this position of kind of being cocky about their position to having this really, you know, sense of urgency as it pertains to approaching you and clearing the air with you, okay? I also feel like they knew this from the beginning as well. There was something about your energy that was very nurturing to them, very solid to them, but they had to find out for sure, okay? I feel like this is just how this masculine is wired. Things just have to make sense. They have to have the proof. They have to, you know, you may have went through a lot with this masculine energy um, simply because you know, they felt like they couldn't be open and honest with you at that time. But something has definitely shifted with them here. The tables have turned completely within this connection, okay? And I feel like they're receiving some type of nudge like from their soul to move forward, to take the action, to do something. Um, and this is something that they've never, never done for anyone. And this kind of solidifies the fact that you are their divine feminine because you can get them just with your energy alone even from a distance to do things that they've never even considered okay let's get the next message here so the next message we have is you were my biggest lesson okay so if this masculine were to be a hundred percent honest with you divine feminine they would tell you that they feel like you've literally changed everything, okay? But not in a way that you may think. So this is directly tied to your personal journey. So I feel like you may be definitely assuming a different stance and this is changing the energy of your connection. Whatever this is, they definitely feel this on a soul level. And it's activating something within their emotional body that may be very uncomfortable, but also very necessary. So this is a masculine who is no longer willing to hold back emotionally because it's put them in a position where they can lose the person that they really want. And that person is you, Divine Feminine. They feel like you have been their biggest lesson on love, on how it's supposed to feel, what it looks like, but more importantly, how to know if it's real. So the secret that this masculine has been holding is that they are absolutely in love with you, but they also know that you are in love with them as well. So the move that they're planning is for them to kind of get this ultimate confirmation from you, just so they know that they're not alone in how they feel. Um, and I'm getting that this is a huge step from them. So maybe you haven't had this type of dialogue before within this connection, but where they are right now, they're deeply desiring to have this type of exchange with you, Divine Feminine. Something within their soul needs this confirmation from you. They also know that this connection is real because the way that they feel has never gone away. So this may be a connection that's been through many ups and downs or moments that were tough to deal with emotionally, but it never changed their heart. And their biggest regret is holding back from you and potentially putting you in a position where you had to kind of choose yourself or them. Wow. So yeah, this, this energy is very intense. They're also very, very apologetic. This masculine genuinely wonders how you view them and if your feelings have changed due to their actions. So Divine Feminine, depending on where you are, their biggest concern is if you are even open to hearing them out, if you even want to see them, if you want to speak to them. So something major could have happened in the recent past. You could have cut this energy off totally. Um, I feel like your person is definitely in this very apologetic energy because they know that they put you in a tough position to make solely based on how they were showing up in this connection, okay? But this is definitely 
someone who's wondering if your feelings have changed because they want to do things different with, differently with you at this time, okay? So, whatever life took them when you were separated or at a distance, it definitely taught them a major lesson. But this was a lesson that they had to learn on their own, okay? And your energy played a major part in this. Let's get the next message here. Oh. Yeah, we have taken a different approach. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, they they had to go back to the drawing board and rethink their entire approach here. Okay. But they're definitely feeling this sense of urgency when it comes to you. You may be coming off in a way, Divine Feminine, where you seem totally unfazed by this masculine, okay? But what they don't know and what they don't see is that you have begun to really trust the timing of your life. So you may be meeting new people, you may be doing new things, but you feel as if everything is happening and unfolding in your life for a reason. And you're at this place where you're not really willing to question that, okay? This is also why this masculine kind of views you as a challenge because you march to the beat of your own drum, okay? And they definitely feel like this is your best attribute. You're the type of fem you're the type of feminine energy that will definitely choose yourself, even if it's over them, okay? This is something that's playing on their minds over and over and over again. It's driving their thoughts, their actions. And this energy is very, very intense right now. But what's interesting about the dynamic of your connection is that although these barriers may present themselves as a, as a challenge to this masculine, this is something that they're prepared to face in order to get to you. So their entire approach has just shifted. They feel as if they kind of have to play by your rules now instead of them kind of being the person who was in charge of this. Um, now they're trying to they're assuming a more curious energy to where they're trying to figure out where you are mentally and emotionally and how they can kind of get on the same page as you, okay? You're feeling very, very intense emotions as well, Divine Feminine, but I'm, I'm getting you're appearing externally very, very confident in where you are in your heart and in your mind at this time. And this is definitely triggering your person, but it's triggering them in, in the best way possible. Let's get the last message here. Okay, so the last message we have is, tell me what you need. Oh, wow. Yeah, this, this masculine is about to approach you, okay? And when they do, you will definitely be able to feel the shift that they have made internally. This is someone who has had the opportunity to be at both ends of this relationship. So if you identify with that runner chaser dynamic, this may have played a huge role in the delays here. But where they are right now, the truth has been revealed about you in a way that they can no longer ignore. And this is definitely pulling on them like they've never felt before here, okay? They now seek to understand how they can love you in a way that you truly feel seen and understood. So this is a masculine who has lived most of their lives operating from their mind, trying to make sense of everything, being calculated and holding back until they felt comfortable, not realizing that this has caused major strain on your connections and maybe many of their connections, okay? But now they want to know what you need from them, Divine Feminine. Their heart space is definitely open and they're seeking to connect with you on a much deeper level. So if you've been at a distance from your person and you're wondering why, this is why, okay? They have been holding back emotionally in a major way. And for whatever reason, they felt as if they would be able to navigate this connection in that way but the tables have definitely turned, okay? And they have kind of got a taste of their own medicine. So you're someone who is definitely irreplaceable in their lives. And they want to show you this from a real raw place, okay? So 
even if they don't know if you're going to be open to this, to open to this kind of emotional expression, they really, really, you know, that's not stopping them. They're going to be coming towards you. They want to speak to you. Um, I feel like they're willing to do whatever it is to kind of repair this connection. So this could definitely be a fresh start depending on where you are, Divine Feminine. But your, your person is definitely hoping so, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and end the reading right here. If you resonated with this message, be sure to hit the like button on the way out. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel and I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Bye.